Oh, it feels good because uh, yesterday was a very difficult day. Obviously, Friday we had a really strong day. Um, and today it was not an easy race. Time management was bigger than what we expected, especially in the first part of the race, trying to take to keep the, the medium under control, which was uh, uh, very difficult, especially with the rears in that first stint. But uh, all in all, we did a, a good uh, race management, which uh, helped us to get P2. Good to be back on the podium. Still a lot of work to do to get uh, the Red Bulls, but uh, we are doing some step forwards. How far along sorting out this tyre degradation problem you've had, do you think the team are, can you give a percentage at all of how, because you've, you've said that the degradation is the issue for you guys in, at the moment. There seem to be improvements, is that fair? Um, yes, there are, some, uh, there are some improvements. It felt a little bit better. Um, then overall, I think we are lacking pace because if you look at the beginning of the stint or at the end of the stint, it's not like there's a big difference. It's just that our relative pace, we are just slower than Red Bull at the moment. So. Uh, Today, I don't think tyre management was our biggest issue. It was just that we were slower than Red Bull. And just finally from me, your teammate held up, Sergio, defended brilliantly. I don't know how much you're aware of that, but it looks as though that hold up from him enabled you to hang on to that P2 without having Sergio breathing down your neck for the last 10 laps. Yeah, well, Carlos did a great job for, for that. I was trying, I mean, I was aware that Checo was coming. I didn't know how quickly he would pass uh, Carlos. So I was trying to manage those hard to push whenever he was getting in front of Carlos, but uh, Carlos, Carlos made my life a bit easier by, by doing a great defense. I could see all of that on the screen, which was quite exciting. Um, and uh, yeah, that, that was good. Well done. Thanks. Great job.